<laughs> That's better. What's up, everybody? I'm about to show you something that is going to blow your freaking minds. <laughs> I've already looked at it. I, I guess I'm sort of speechless, so I'm gonna have to work on this a little bit. This is, in the lawn care world, a complete and total game changer. Yeah. Before I show you what's in the box. Who's in the box? What's in the box? And I, I know the box doesn't look like much. Don't worry about that. We had to ship it this way. Couldn't show the retail packaging yet because we didn't want anybody taking pictures of it or letting the cat out of the bag too early. So this was shipped in just a standard box just to keep things kind of Hush, hush, just like they do with cars and things when you see them all covered up, it's the same thing. What's in the fucking box? Before I show it to you, I just wanna take a quick little brief history here. Over in the back corner over there, I have something I wanna show you real quick. Let me just grab it. See this? This is an antique, clearly. I just hit the microphone. This is a Dylan McGuire mower. They started in the 1870s. This is a little bit later than that, probably like 1895 to 1910, somewhere in that range. This is the A616 model, I think is what it was. Um, all steel. One, two, three, four, five blades on the reel. This actually still does work. Wooden roller, wooden handle, all the way up, wood at the top. I mean, this thing is freaking awesome and clearly built to last. This is an heirloom mower. So I, I'm actually gonna be restoring this. So if you're into real mowers or into antique kind of stuff, you're gonna wanna just hang around because I'm gonna be doing some work on this. Anyway, 125, 130, 140 year old mower, still in great working condition, built really well. Company out of Indiana. And that leads me to the next thing. See that, it still rolls. This company in here, also out of Indiana. Family owned, been around for a long time. The family actually still works on these mowers. I'm gonna show this to you and, I mean really game changer is the best, biggest word for it. Let me introduce to you the world's first autonomous reel mower. Come on baby, loose. I mean, you can tell straight up on the construction. Look at this bed knife, razor sharp freaking blade, the traction device here. Oh man, look at that. Are you kidding me right now? Fully autonomous. See? I. Now maybe the batteries might be in the side. No wires. Not exactly sure how. It's not autonomous. What? Do you even know what autonomous means? Yeah, I know what it means. It means. Fully automatic? It is not automatic. What do you mean it's not fully automatic? It's a manual mower. Manual? It's, oh my god. You mean this is like the one I, oh. I'm sorry, I totally misunderstood. No! You lied! You're a fucking liar! You silly, silly Hudsons. Uh, no, so I wanted to bring this thing up. It is not a fully autonomous mower. Absolutely not. This is the Hudson Star body. Now right now, if you were to jump over to the Hudson Star shop, you're gonna be able to buy the basic mower that they have over there. Eight blade, non-solid front roller here. It, it kind of just a setup so that you can mow grass up to like an inch and a half. The eight blade reel works perfect for home lawns. This one here is still the 11 blade, like what I have on my green. So the extender blocks on there, you can tip the mower up and now you have something that can cut more conventional lawns. So, sorry, there is not an autonomous reel mower yet. However, the guys over at Hudson Star are continuing to really work hard to innovate and come up with some new and different ideas. And there are some things in the works that you guys are gonna be pretty excited about. You'll hear about them first right here. So for those of you that don't know, I've been using the Hudson Star reel mower for my golf green and I cut down to about a 10th of an inch and it just does an incredible freaking job. It's, it's such a wonderful piece of equipment and it's light and it's easy to use. There's no big mower, there's no battery, there's no sound. Like I can get up super early in the morning, go cut my green, and it doesn't bother a single person. This is something that for like golf course professionals and people like that who need to go mow collars and stuff early in the morning, yeah, throw this in the back of the gator, run out, cut stuff. It's incredible. So if you jump over to the HudsonStarShop.com and there's links down below, you can take a look at these and there is a special running on that eight blade mower that I was talking about. And you can get into one of the most incredible mowers that you've ever laid your eyes on. And one of the reasons I wanted to compare it to this other Dylan McGuire mower, this is an heirloom mower. It's virtually maintenance free. Yes, you still need a back lap. Yes, you need to sharpen things like that. But this thing is sealed up. 
It is tight and it will cut grass so clean for so long. And if you wanna find out more, click on this video right here. Oh, and by the way, happy April 1st, everyone. Bye. I said bye.